Hello, this is just a, a little video about some small repairs on my Bell uh, 130 cement mixer. What's happened is the rivets have worn out at the back, so there's water leaking out of the back of it. Um, so my plan is to take the drum off, take the uh, mixer ring off and re-secure it all up. So you can see on this bit here just how loose and wobbly it is. So. You, you can imagine how much water is coming out of the back of it there when the mix is on. And you can see it's it's quite well worn down because there's daylight coming through the rivet holes. And here we have it with half a bucket of water in and you can see that it's it's just totally just coming straight through. So my plan is to take the the drum off and uh, reseal reseal it all up, which should sort it. Taking the drums off on these is really easy, it's just this one clip here that just clips up. When you've got two hands free it takes about five seconds to take off and the best way to take the drum off itself is to put it with the drum side down and lift the frame off and then it's totally clear and you're not uh, hitting the ball bearings or anything like that. So here we are with the drum off and you can see there the rivets, I think there's like six or seven round round it. I'm going to drill through them and put some M6 uh, 20 mil roofing bolts through it because it's a bit stronger than what rivets are. Here we are, we all all drilled through, and ready to go. And obviously, somebody's tried repairing the problem because they've run a bead of silicon all the way along that's not worked. So, I'm just going to clean it all up, uh, take the silicon off and the bits of concrete and stuff like that, anything that might be in the way for when the mixer ring goes back on. See it now all cleaned up, uh, pre-drilled out at 6mm, so all, all ready to go. So we've got stainless steel bolts and then uh, some rubber washers that should make it uh, waterproof stop it leaking out the back and you can see the new bolts in so it's just a case of popping it back onto mixer and there you go job done it's back on and there's a good half a bucket of water in it at minute so if it were still a problem it would be leaking out of the back like it were at the start of the video and that's it i hope it's been helpful to you